Hi, my name's Carl Lautman, and I make kinetic sculpture. Recently, I started to think about using AI image generators, like Midjourney or Dolly, to help in the design of my work. But I very quickly realized that getting an image was just half the battle, if that. The problem is, how do you go from an image to something physical? I have a 3D printer and a bunch of other tools, but nobody just looks at a picture, particularly something complex that's typical of what an AI produces, and says, no problem. Hold my beer while I go bang that out. At a minimum, you need an engineering drawing and ideally a CAD model. And with the right kind of model, you can just slice it and send it to a 3D printer. Now, I could manually create the model in a CAD program, but that can take a lot of time, especially for something organic with lots of curves, which is the kind of thing I was thinking about. But it occurred to me that there just might be a tool or service capable of doing that for me, maybe even using AI, with just a few images. And a quick search brought me to Katum. At the same time I was thinking about solving this problem for myself, it was slowly dawning on me that other people might be facing the same problem. How could they turn their images into physical objects? I'd also just stumbled across an online course called Innovating with AI, with the twin goals of providing an overview of the AI industry and equipping the students with the tools to develop and launch an AI business in 30 days, complete with a demo day to help with the launch. So the stars seemed to be aligning for starting a business for helping people turn their AI dreams into physical reality. And based on my initial test with Katum, I knew they could provide one of the crucial ingredients and not just for the minimum viable product, but at scale through their API. They make hundreds of models a day for some of their customers, so I knew they could grow with me. Now, I'm making this video one day after that demo day, so it's still early for Nakara. But there's no question I wouldn't have been able to even get here without Kato, and I'm looking forward to continuing my journey with them.